and go. Action? Yeah. Okay. Hello, everyone. <laughs> we're here at boiling point. Okay, boiling point is where we're going to get the pot of water off the fire. Just ready to prepare some typical Argentinian mate. Mate argentino, in other words. <laughs> As you can see, steaming, it's about to boil. I mean, that means I just overdid it a bit because the water is not supposed to boil. So we're going to let it cool down a bit. Most um, mate fanatics don't do this, actually. This is a fact. If the water boils, they would throw the water. Okay, I'm not kidding here. And they would put more water in the pot and boil it up. As you may imagine, electric, um, you know, those heating pot, electric pots, aren't valid for this kind of thing. You have to go through the whole process of the water heating up. You gotta use a flower teapot. Exactly. <laughs> a hippie teapot. Now this, as you can see, is yerba. Yerba mate. <laughs> yerba mate. The plant growing in the northeast region of Argentina, Misiones a lot. Very big, jungly plant. Chopped into little pieces and drunken in this little gourd. We're going to put some in here. Just about half of the... How much, huh? Yeah, yeah you do put much, but um, just about there, okay? Cool. Okay? Mm -hmm. It's about half the the, um, the size of the, you know, the amount. Now, my, my technique is to shake it a bit because it has a little bit of dust, so we don't want the dust to mix with everything. So by shaking it, we get dust all the way to the bottom. Now we have this shape with all the sherba on one side and a big hole on the other side. We're going to put the water in the hole. We're going to try not to get the water on top of all the sherba. There we go. Put it on the side? On the, yeah, on the side where the hole is. Okay. Once we get to the top, we let it sit for about a few minutes. So that we're gonna put the water in, in the what is this called in English? Thermos. Thermos. Yes. What do you call? What do you call it? Thermo. Thermo. All right. So that way we keep the water perfect temperature for the mate. Okay. Okay. So anyway, we're gonna let this sit for a few minutes, so the whole you know sherba leaves get soaked, and we'll be back in a second with more. Mate techniques. <laughs>